Hey, how's it going? Can you hear me? I can. Okay, I'm glad I got it working. <laughs> uh, I've, ne I've never done Google Voice before, actually. Uh, everything's new to people. You know, everything's easy once you know it. Right. This is the first time for everything, and this is my first time on Google Voice. I hear you. Well, you sound pretty clear. Okay, that's good. You're also particularly clear, so this is great. <sighs> okay, um, so the the reason why I've posted, I've, I've typically had a pretty passive approach. Um, uh, you know, I've always had a really passive approach, and I've never really allowed politics to be the divisive tool like that makes me consider someone unworthy of friendship or uh, you know an indecent uh, most of the time i recognize that we have like sometimes different origins and different like foundational beliefs that cause us to believe in specific ways um and that's been my approach now, for the I'm most not, part if, if, I, if, I, if i retort to that uh i agree and i i think i think that uh uh we're being pushed in that direction i think we're being pushed to 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 uh, magnify differences we may have, I think there's an agenda. Okay. So I don't disagree with that. the The thing is, I can't allow the fact that there are people that will benefit, um, whose goal it is to make us more divisive. I can't allow that to hand, hand wave like every other issue that actually arises. While I recognize what we do with the information we acquire, it helps us to be responsible. But ultimately, just the fact that there is a dark presence that would be trying to divide us doesn't excuse or dismiss the argument when someone is trying to highlight a grave injustice brought on by specific people. Now, mind you, okay, the way you word that, uh, I, I would find it hard to disagree with. Okay. Okay, but 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 mind you, um, it all depends on what you mean when you say that. Now, now to get to the to get to the heart of the point that you had brought up before. Mm -hmm. Again, Black Lives Matter. Um, if you put that in the text upon its basic English meaning, as I stated before, I have found not one being who would disagree with it. Okay. Now, mind you, I'm not saying they're not. I'm saying I have found none. Mm -hmm. Now, in the text upon which I think you are trying to phrase it, um, in reference to All Lives Matter, it's 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 a a, a direct it's a direct uh, segregation within itself. Okay, so here's where we have a problem. So when you say that you have never seen the per you've never met a person that disagrees with the statement that black lives matter why would you why do you why would you have you experienced people that felt compelled to retort with all lives matter in response to someone saying black lives matter have you ever witnessed that i have okay so then I have i have i witnessed the retort yes okay so then the fact that you feel the need to re retort or rebut means that you tacitly disagree with the thing that's stated so for instance if i say it's really hot in here and someone says Mm, I feel fine. What they mean is it's not particularly hot and I don't agree with you, right? So when someone says black lives matter, when you feel compelled to rebut or compelled to retort, then at that point, that means that in some kind of way that you disagree with some po some portion of what's being stated. Okay, and, and I understand. Well, actually, it, it's kind of shocking that you respond to me this way because if someone were to say to me black lives matter okay i as a god-fearing man um don't look at color as much as some may okay, okay. especially as okay now i would say that all lives matter i would i would agree with that what is okay how much more valuable is your life than mine so okay, and I think this runs into one of the biggest problems with 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 the statement in general. When 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 people say Black Lives Matter, right? That's just a basic statement. Obviously, like as as oh, already, no. No, hold on, let me finish. Uh, as I already stated, sure. the two is implied. Uh, so when we say Black Lives Matter, it's meaning obviously in context, Black Lives Matter as well as everyone else's life. Secondly, no one's ever dismissing another life in that in that in that statement, and no one's talking about um, a, a hierarchy and saying that we matter more. That's never been stated. It's never been implied, like ever in Black Lives Matter. Uh, okay, I beg to differ with you because the statement 
in itself is racist. It states when you say Black Lives Matter, I'm, when you say um, Black Lives Matter, you, you're saying that you're, you're segregating, saying only Black Lives Matter. Okay, good. Let me stop you there. Why not? Why no, not? no, 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 no. But I gotta stop you there. I gotta stop you there because see, that's just okay. simply not true. Have you? Okay, uh, I, I really hate. I've always hated memes because people use a bunch of memes, but I feel like a bunch of them really come into play here. And so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. When someone says "save the whales," do you hear "save the whales" only? Do you hear "save the whales" and no other fish matter, or do you hear "whales are more valuable than other fish"? When someone says "save the whales," what do you hear when they make that statement? I say that all whales are being endangered. Okay, all whales are being endangered. Now, a whale is a fish. Does that mean that all trout are being endangered? Does that no, mean all sir, catfish? No, are... sir, no, oh. sir, no, sir, no, sir, no, sir, no, sir, no, sir. Okay, because a human being is a human being. Okay, sure. uh, a lizard is a lizard. Mm -hmm. A whale is a whale. Okay, a whale is a whale. Okay, it's not. It's not. It's not. A, it's not a barracuda. It's not an eel. Mm -hmm. It's not a goldfish. A whale is a fish. So, okay. okay. So a whale is a fish. Top, so okay. hold on. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Okay, just listen. to make sure we're, we're keeping co co uh, consistent with the analogy here. A whale, by species, okay. is a fish. Just like all humans, by species. A whale species. is a mammal. Is a, is, a man, is a man a fish? A whale is a mammal. Is, I, th I thought a whale was a... T okay. Fine. Perfect. Then, if we're, when we're saying all whales matter, okay, then we can name literally every other mammal. Great. So, no. so wait, hold no. on, wait, 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 one second. So if you're saying we're categori categorizing by species, then a whale being a mammal, in that case, when we say uh, that all whales matter, I mean, that save the whales, does that mean that we're talking about save the humans too? Because humans are mammals. Are we talking about cats? No, no. So you put it, you put it in that category. I stated that whales were also mammals. I didn't include them in your context. Wait, wait, which context? Well, I'm sorry, I'm not, maybe I'm not following. The context that, that being a whale is also a mammal, then all whales and mammals should matter. No, sir. Whales specifically, and to the point you reference, you reference right now, all, you know, save a whale, you know, there was a problem there. There were, there were whales. Listen. That's, no, that's exactly my really point. Quickly. No, 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 it's my turn. Real quick, I gave you yours. Help okay. me out, and, and you'll okay. have yours again. Sure. And I will listen humbly. Okay. okay. So the problem I think we're having here is again, I think this is all done by design. Now, let me ask you a question, okay? If, if, if black people, if the African American is being abused right now, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. Could you find a more, a more uh, disruptive, a more, uh, uh, how should I say, uh, uh, sketchy term to use? I mean, why can't we say um, um, uh, uh, stop, uh, stop, uh, uh, African American abuse. Okay. Can't we say, you know, uh, enough is enough? I mean, there are many ways I'm sure you could come up with that could give us a more, more, uh, a more harmonious uh, uh, a way to express our anger for what's happening. Okay, so this is done by design. Black Lives Matter is, is, is saying is, it's saying two things. It's controversial and it's done by design. Okay, so I'm gonna disagree with that. Um, and so yes, while I do think there are a billion different phrases that we could have chosen, um, just as there's a billion different ways that we could protest, I feel that people with the, who have the intention of literally countering everything that happens. I don't think that the phrase Black Lives Matter is particularly divisive, except for by the individuals who typically want to dismiss the claims of Black Lives Matter by retorting with All Lives Matter. That's number one. Number two, I don't think, again, I don't believe it's productive to hand wave all of the claims that are made by Black Lives Matter with the intention, uh, b b uh, by, by referring to the intent of people to divide us, right? Like, while that's true, there is an intent to divide us. It's also true simultaneously that blacks are um, obviously, uh, we're, we're disproportionately uh, brutalized by police officers. Our sentences are obviously significantly more, uh, significantly longer than the average American. Uh, we are policed more. Um, and there are several other forms of systemic oppression that are well, specifically... Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, I got you, wait, okay, let me finish. So, yeah, there are significantly um, large amounts of different areas of systemic oppression that are specifically designed to mm -hmm. oppress blacks and prevent their development. So, with that being said, it's kind of 
tautological. But anyway, with that being said, I, I think that the problem that we're having here is you're choosing, when you hear the phrase Black Lives Matter, you're choosing to hear in some way, shape, or form, though it has never been stated, that Black Lives Matter more than other lives and also that Black Lives Matter exclusively, which neither of those have been stated, and neither of those are neither of those are directly implied in the English. Let me fill you in on a direct a, a quid a quid pro quo, okay? Right here, right now. What's the first thing anybody would think of when they say Black Lives Matter? I would think that the average quickly. Okay, sure. I think they would most think. Okay, so they're saying that Black Lives Matter. They're, they're saying what, what the sentence states that Black Lives have value. Okay. 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 For me, I would say, what happened to everybody else? Okay. So again, I'm not. I'm not. No, no, mind you. No, mind you. I can say that and still believe Black Lives Matter. Can I not? Uh, sure. So let me ask you a question, really quick. I think we're running into a problem here again. So this is what, I, if this is what you're telling me that your initial thing that that was the initial thing you've heard that was the initial thing you took away from it. There have been significant. I'm here. I'm here now having a conversation with you, explaining to you what the people who typically use the phrase Black Lives Matter mean by it. If you choose to maintain your erroneous interpretation of the phrase, at this point, that would be you in error. You're choosing at this point to ignore the countless expositions, the countless demonstrations that we obviously do not believe it in the inter interpretation that you're taking. So when you're doing so, you at this point, when we've expounded so many times, how like what exactly we're, we're talking about Th at this point you're doing so and it, it seems intentional to me because there's no possible way i i could I, I, i'm you're on facebook just like i am there's no possible way you haven't seen the countless um the countless analogies that people have came up with to demonstrate what exactly the phrase means there's no possible way you've never heard a person explain to you that they do not mean black lives matter exclusively or black lives matter more than others there's no possible way you inter you, you, heard, you heard any of those phrases so the fact that you would still maintain that this is what you're interpreting is intentional that's why I feel like it's particularly divisive. That's why I feel like it's dismissive. And that's why I feel like it's denigrating. Okay. Well, again, I will, I will speak in plain English. When the first response, when you give somebody a, a quid pro quo as to uh, when somebody says Black Lives Matter, in my opinion, my lone opinion, I believe is, is not of my own, but I believe I can only say my own opinion is that my first response would be to go to why don't all lives matter you see what's going on when you say black lives matter again you're concentrating on black mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. you're not concentrating on unity mm -hmm. you're not concentrating on equality you're concentrating on 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 black lives matter mm -hmm. okay well what about everybody else now when you say now that i've heard all this and i've heard what you say why can't you just go with black lives matter well, because if I were to go out and, and, and hold up the sign, Black Lives Matter, another person is going to come to me, and, and, and I'm going to have to explain to them, yes, all lives matter, okay? Now, shouldn't that tell you something about the name that's been chosen to, to, to bring us together? Okay, so for one, I'm not going to buy for a second that the average person doesn't understand the intent behind Black Lives Matter, except for the people who intentionally choose to maintain an erroneous interpretation for the previously stated reason. But because of the fact that you're a Christian, I think I have a great analogy for you. Um, okay. I'm pretty sure that you read the Bible. So with that being said, there was a, uh, there was a sermon in which Jesus specifically mentioned his sheep. And he was talking about how he first he talked about the prodigal son, and then he also mentioned the fact that when for a shepherd, when that one sheep goes ahead and, and the and one lost sheep out of them all, correct. right? The one lost sheep, well. and he says that he would go and he would go take care of that lost sheep and leave the ninety nine for that one lost sheep, right? Okay. Okay. Now, when in that analogy, in that in that uh, allegory that Jesus presented. Do you think the shepherd, in his intention to go for that one lost sheep, do you believe that his intention is to say that that sheep matters more than the other sheep or that the other 99 don't matter when he's doing so? <laughs> Good one. Problem is that they're all sheep. Okay. okay. The problem is Great. You're, 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 sure. trying to, you're, you're, trying so, fight, you're trying to fight the wall of basic English, and, and I know not. that I'm not the only person I'm you're going to have a fight with. Listen, Black Lives Matter, Okay. I, no one is saying they don't. Then and why you, do you, you feel the need to rebut? Uh, uh, excuse me? Then why do you feel the need to rebut? Because, because in, basic, in basic English terms, mm -hmm. 
-hmm. okay? By letter of English, by definition, mm -hmm. Black Lives Matter, when you say Black Lives Matter, it's, segreg it's segregatory, okay? It, it segregates. Mm -hmm. It's saying Black Lives Matter. Okay. No oh. one's saying they don't, but what happened to everybody else? Okay. Listen, what I'm saying is that, what I'm saying is that Black Lives Matter is segregating. It's, okay. it's, it's black. It's Why distinguishing, right? You'd say that it's distinguishing at that point? What, what I'm saying is, is that you're, it's, 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 uh, it's, it, it eliminates, it, it eliminates others. It's saying this, but not that. No, it's not. Okay, okay so oh, matter, but, oh. so the reason why I feel like this analogy is so perfect in that situation is because in that analogy, in the allegory that Jesus presented there, he didn't refer to all 99 of his sheep as lost sheep. He referred to one sheep as a lost sheep. Now, the fact that that one sheep is separated from the rest of them is cause for concern. In the same sense, while the, with the intent behind Black Lives Matter is not to say hey, we're, all, we're, we're different or we're separate. It's not, the intention is not to segregate. The, the intention is to highlight. When he used the word lost sheep there, his intent is to highlight a sheep in danger. So in the same sense, when people use the phrase Black Lives Matter, its intent is not to be segregatory, as you said. The intent is to highlight that a specific sect of, of, of human beings are in danger disproportionately. So in the same sense, the, w w w while when he's going for that lost sheep, his intent is not to divide. When we're specifically specifically highlighting the issues that face black blacks, it's, our intent is not to divide. Our intent is to highlight a specific issue. And here, and again, hold on, one, one more thing that I want to say very clearly, and this is why I feel like I've taken such a very strict and stringent stance on this statement so far, is specifically the fact that I don't feel I, I feel it's dehumanizing, I feel it's dismissive for me to explain to you, and I don't think I'm a particularly inarticulate man, for me to explain to you exactly what we mean behind the term, being a person that would be directly affected by the confines of what that statement says, and for you to sit here, despite me explaining to you rather articulately, rather patiently, exactly what the intent, the meaning, the, the, the connotation and denotation of what this phrase means, for you to somehow, even still, despite Despite all of that, come to an erroneous conclusion is dismissive by the very definition of the word. That's what makes me feel dehumanized. It makes me feel invalidated. The fact that I can explain it to you and you still refuse to accept the exact interpretation as I'm explaining it to you. That is dismissive okay, the, the by fire, definition. The difference between the sheep. The sheep, okay? Okay, well, what you're saying is... is, is, is Wait, I feel like is, you're not going to address is, what I just said. Are, are you... Are you I know I heard what you said, but I don't. I don't. I don't. I, I heard exactly what you said, and, do you and I too with that? am a very articulated man. I agree. Now, mind you, I heard what you said, but I still don't fathom how you could how you could be upset when 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 somebody wants to say all lives matter. Now, I, just I believe. I, oh, okay. No. Okay. Now, what I'm saying is, I believe that Black Lives Matter. Okay, can I, can I, okay, now, do you want me to, to specifically, you know, wear the shirt and the hat, Black Lives Matter, but that in itself, it's, 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 it's saying, it's, it, you know, why can't, let me ask you a question, are you a man? What, you're asking me, am I a man? Are you a man? I feel like yeah. that's a belittling question right question. there. question. It's, it is. It is not in the text upon which I'm putting it. I didn't say okay. it was. I didn't uh, say it was I, you, uh, racist. I said it's belittling. Okay. Well, no. The reason why I'm asking it is because all men are created equal. Okay. All men. Okay. Not. Okay. So, so, I look at it as, you know, why can't we get along? Oh, why can't like you, you see this? What sure. I believe is that this is this 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 is working. Okay, it, we are being divided. Okay, and it's not because I don't think you're my brother. It's because the words that they chose to use are creating conflict. No, it's, okay? the, it's the words that now, they chose to use. You and I, with. you and I, could go out and have lunch, and we could go out and become friends, and, and our kids will play together. Okay, but because somebody created this three-letter, this three-word acronym. Okay, this this three-letter, this, this three-word, this three-word saying. Okay, all of a sudden, if I don't believe that just Black Lives Matter, okay, which is how it's written in the text, do me a favor, go to Webster's and 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 and, and understand exactly.
exactly what it says. Yes, Black Lives Matter. But when you say Black Lives Matter, it excludes me. It does not. Am I? It, it, it doesn't? No, not by definition. So, In basic English. In basic English. The only way Listen, that the, wait, no, 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 hold on. I got to stop you. 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 Because again, you're doing it and it's intentional at this point. So never. It's intentional? It has to be. I'm intentionally doing what? It, you're intentionally adding one word in order to mis misconstrue the actual interpretation of what the phrase means. Because like, as you just did in, in your attempt to try to misconstrue the words, you use the word just. See, when you say just Black Lives Matter, at that point, yes, it would be exclusionary, right? When you say Black right. Lives Matter exclusively, when you add those phrases on, then it would be exclusionary. When you say Black Lives okay. Matter, if you if you believe all lives matter, then that means you would believe Black Lives Matter also. So as I explained at the very beginning of well, this then conversation, why can't we do that? Why can't we do that? Why can't we say Black Lives Matter also? Okay, so now, now you wouldn't exclude anybody, right? Sure. So and it would be harmonious, would it not? So that here, so what happens is now at this point it becomes a semantics war where you want to change the phrase that has been trending for God knows how many years, specifically with the intention of removing all doubts of, exclu of, of, of of exclusivity when we've already recognized and we've already expounded it and, and, and explained that the word itself is not intended to be exclusionary and exactly what the word means. At this point, for me, I feel it would be more injurious because of the fact that as it stands now, when people look up the phrase Black Lives Matter, they are able to find a history. The history is located there. When you start a new trend, then we would have to try at this point to tie the two together. And now at this point, a lot of the history, a lot of the uh, historical context disappears. So at this point, I don't think that that's the most wise thing to do. However... I, it just as easy as you believe we could include the word also in the thing, it, it, also in the phrase. Do you feel like it's that big of a challenge? Okay, hold on. Let, let me let me ask you a question really quick. I, I got it. When I say the phrase "Black Lives Matter" to you, what do you believe I mean? I believe that you mean just what you say. What do I say? What does it mean? What does that mean? Expl that's, say it in your own words. Lives. Black lives do. Black lives do, in fact, matter. Okay. Do you believe that I'm saying that other lives don't matter? I believe you're being discriminatory. Okay. So you're saying. So you. So okay. So then, can you explain that in your own words? You're saying when I say the word Black Lives Matter, go ahead and explain it to me exactly what you think I'm saying in as much context as you can provide. Okay. I believe that, uh, in fact. All men are created equal. All men should be judged by their... How is that put? All men should be judged by the content Wait, of their character that's not rather than the pigmentation of their skin. But that's not answering no, my question. Yes, I'm is. sorry. No, no, no. Lives, I asked you... No, how, no. Many times, how many times have you said or heard Black Lives Matter and somebody said, don't all lives matter? How many times have you heard it? Okay, so and, let me and, stop and, you. And you tell Again, me why you think so. I asked you a question and I don't feel like you're answering my question. My question was, when I say, when Lauren Riley, the person that you've met, when I say the phrase Black Lives Matter, now at this point we've had a conversation for quite some time and I've explained to you in great detail exactly what I mean. This is what I'm referring to. So now that I've done so, now that you're aware, because I've articulated it to you, exactly what I meant when I used the phrase Black Lives Matter, I need you to repeat to me what I mean when I say the word Black Lives Matter so that I can be sure that you're actually hearing me. I believe that you think, uh, excuse me, when you say Black Lives Matter, mm -hmm. you know what I think. I, I, as a Christian man, I believe that Black Lives Matter. Or, my question is, what do I Period. think when I'm saying the word? What, what do you believe that I believe when I, when I use the phrase? How am I meaning it? Explain it to me. As, 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 as the same as I see it, Black Lives Matter. Mm -hmm. do, do, you, do you think that I mean it exclusively? Do, do, do you believe um, that do you believe my intent when I use the phrase black lives matter is to convey that black lives matter and not other lives? I okay I okay I don't think that you are being you yourself are being uh, trying to be exclusive with the term okay 
okay? Mm -hmm. But I do believe the term is extremely controversial. Okay, that, that's fine. You know that by the simple fact that we're having this discussion. Yeah, controversy is necessary when we're, whenever we want dramatic change. Now, I'm glad that you're able to admit no, that. No, hold no, on, no, hold excuse on, me, hold I disagree. Okay. I disagree. Well, Harm harmony is what you want when we're having a dramatic change. Yeah. Harmony is what we need, okay? Racism, you want to know what racism is? I'll tell you exactly what racism is. Mm -hmm. Racism is between me and my circle, you and your circle. Okay, mm -hmm. I don't have racism in my circles. I don't. Mm -hmm. I have friends that have never even brought it up. Okay, and it dies. It dies. The problem we're having here is the fact that you can't get away from CNN, ABC, and Fox News, whoever the hell you want to talk about, bringing it up, constantly putting it in our face. And by the way, you know, do you know how many people get abused by police every year? Okay. Okay. No. no Any so... idea? I saw a woman handcuffed. Okay, handcuffed, sitting on a curb get kicked in the freaking head by a white cop. White okay. woman, white cop. Sure. Okay, listen, racism, racism is, is a living and breathing thing, okay? And, and the, more we, the more we try to, try to, try to uh, 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 put it in the forefront, and you know, you know what's amazing is, is that you watch the news. You know, white cop, black perpetrator, okay? Black this, white that, you know? Why can't it be cop? Why can't it be, you know, this is being, this is being perpetuated. It's being, it's being, it, it, you know, people are, are cultivating this and people are buying into it. I'm okay. not. Okay, so I hear you. So what I hear when you went from what it, well, from everything that you expounded, one, you immediately came with some false accusations that I watched CNN and Fox and ABC, which I do none of. I, now, no, with that, wait, hold on, wait, 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 Okay, if no, I didn't. Just, okay. I didn't intend you. Okay, so hey, so here's a beautiful thing that just happened here. I, the words that you said, I was going to respond to those words that you said. You've explained to me what you mean from it, and now I'm going to listen to what you explained to me about what you mean and update myself and recognize that that wasn't your intention. Why is that so difficult for people to do regarding Black Lives Matter? Because the statement, again, is controversial. Your statement the you statement, just made was offensive because it was honestly inaccurate. I've, I don't watch Fox News. I don't watch CNN. I don't watch ABC. It should have been offensive. It was absolutely not representative of my life and my story and what exactly I do. That's truth. Now, I understand that what you were doing, now that you've explained it to me, I understand that those words were not intended to be directed at me. You've explained that to me. And I'm, I'm taking... You at what your exposition is, as opposed to the words that came out of your mouth, right? Now, hey, when believe, someone, do you believe what I said? huh? Do you believe what I said? I do, which is why I'm, no, which is why I'm no longer offended by it. But I think the analogy holds up in that because you've expounded and explained what you mean. Now, me being a decent human being, I'm going to listen to your exposition, and then I'm going to choose to. Uh, uh, Choose to direct my focus towards your exposition as opposed to the words that, uh, as opposed to my original interpretation of your words. I'm asking you to do the same thing regarding Black Lives Matter. Is that something you're in? Is that something that you just you don't want to do? Are you kidding me? It is something I would love to do. One okay, second. Okay, so what's please. stopping you? All right, no problem. Building and safety. Master Kong. Yes, sir. Can I call you? Can I call you? I'm, I'm right now in the middle of something very important. I'll call you right back. Thank you. I'm sorry. No problem. I'm, uh, I'm on a 15 minute break at work, so go ahead. Uh, you, you, you're saying again? Okay. I'll just, I'll, I guess I can just sum it up. It's really simple. Um, I, I feel that. Like it, just, as I said earlier, I think that enough. Okay, no, happened. no, I got it. I, you, you just got me back to where do I? How do I? Now that you've explained everything, can I accept the fact that Black Lives Matter, as you stated, is something that can be uh, recognized and said with pride as a Christian man? Yes. Okay. Is it? But yes. Okay. And no buts. No buts. Yeah, I, I can accept that. Okay. okay. But here's the deal. Here's the deal. I'm not the first guy to have controversy over this subject. You know that. Okay. Okay. I now, when you want to talk about... I'm sorry? 
I listen. I don't mind controversy. The phrase start, first started being used around 2012 and 2000. I want to say 2011. It dates. It dates really far back. The problem is now we are nine years into this conversation. People have explaining have been explaining for nine years what that phrase means. And any person that still hey, at this any hold on. Let me just. This is what this is. This is the crux of the entire conversation. Any person that still doesn't ex understand what we mean by the phrase Black Lives Matter nine years later is intentionally doing so, which is why I'm saying that person can no longer be, no, no, that person well, isn't genuinely well, a friend. Listen, be careful. Be careful that your, your uh, how shall I say, your compassion, okay, mm -hmm. doesn't, doesn't, doesn't go to hurt things that are good. Oh, I, I, okay? I, I it you're won't. Passionate, you're passionate. You're passionate, okay? I, uh, I, I didn't mean compassion. I mean your passion. Um, and what I mean by that is that you're talking to a man who's happy to have never have known what Black Lives Matter is. And I'm, I'm proud to say that. You know why? Because in my circle, in my circle of whom I have many different colored friends, okay? Mm -hmm. we've, never, we've never had to go there. So take pride and take honor in this, okay? And the circle of, of, of friends that I have in my circle, okay? There is no racism. Take pride in that. Okay. okay. Make it grow. Make this grow. Make it grow through. Make it grow through, through the Antelope Valley. Make it grow through Palmdale. Make it grow through Lancaster. You know what? You think I won't walk beside you when I see injustice to a fellow human being? I believe that I am in the majority. Okay. okay? So now, now what happens is, is when you start seeing these riots and these things, you know, people are getting hurt. People are getting beat. I saw a woman get hit over the head by a man of color with a two by four. How do you think her kids going to react to that? Okay. Racism grows; it only spreads more racism. So take fact, take pride, take take a little joy in the fact that you know, you know, you know a few white guys that 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 don't ever experience racism. No. So here's it's funny that you would ask me to do that. It is actually anathema to me, and here's why: the fact that. We've experienced so much brutality, so much racism, so much injustice in the criminal justice system, so much oppression in pretty much every system of our lives. And the fact, exactly. hold on, wait, let me How finish. No, no, let me finish my point, please. The fact that we've experienced this much and we've gone through every form of protest from kneeling to marching to, uh, to, 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 to voting to legislation, we've done literally everything in our power, like in everything we can to call out to these injustices. The fact that you can sit here in 2020 and tell me that you're completely unaware of what Black Lives Matter means and the reason we're crying sounds numb and dismissive. That's the exact problem. Okay, That's the very me. problem okay. behind what we're experiencing now. It is the people, and I don't believe that you're necessarily racist, but I, I think it's the amount of people that that literally no, you're that, calling that, me naive is what you're calling me no i'm not no. calling you naive i'm calling you dismissive because I, we've done literally everything from whoa, literally whoa, violent okay, that's even that's even worse that's even worse if, okay if, so be. if i were if i were if i were naive i were i'd be ignorant to the fact okay being dismissive is saying you you think i know what it is and choose to look the other way listen that's, if, the, that's what dismissive means sure and after this much i'm, not, I'm not trying to belittle you but, i i don't think you're belittling no, me that's, you're that's not, insulting that's okay. insulting and okay. what I meant to say is that you, you say it's been here since 2012. Okay, yeah, I've been yeah, ignorant of that. Okay, great. Mm -hmm. um, oh, and I'm, sit, I'm trying to sit here and tell you that you, you, you are up in arms right yeah. now. Make no mistake. Oh, for sure. Okay? I'm not denying and, and, and that. Borders, that and that, that, that can border on racism. Uh, wait. You, oh. you, 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 can, you can look at people in a certain light. Listen, racism doesn't go one way. Racism wait. Is, is, is colorblind. Okay, I gotta stop you. I gotta okay, stop wait. you. Wait, hold on. I gotta stop you really quick because I'm not disagreeing that black people can be racist. What have I demonstrated in this conversation that would signify that I'm racist? Well, you're stating that you're stating that I'm I'm being dismissive of things. You're you're saying that you did you I say know, white uh, people in general? Or did assuming, I say you? You're assuming. Wait, did I say you? Yeah. Or did I say white people in general? You said me. Okay, so then what about I'm what, being dismissive. Okay, so then how would that translate to me being racist if I didn't talk about white people in general, if I'm just talking to you and the conversation we're having right now? I'm sorry, what's that again? How could you imply that I'm racist from me talking to you specifically and addressing the thing that you said? How can you I'm saying how can, you can be. I'm saying you can I'm, Have I demonstrated wait, that I'm racist in this conversation thus far? No, you have not. Okay, so then why would you say that? 
I'm saying hey, you can be. Everybody can be. Okay, you're so you're say just, you can't? You say you haven't? So you're basically just saying in general that it, all people can be racist. That's that's. I don't understand how that relates to the conversation we're having right now. Because you implied ah. that I, Lauren Riley, could be racist. And that I that that what I was explaining to you was racist. That's what you said. Do you are you taking that back? Or do you, are, are you well, saying? I, okay, I believe I believe that that when you when you start putting segregation. Uh, when you start putting segregation in the forefront, and you and you tell me, you told me that that if you believe all lives matter, you don't want to be my friend. Now that to me, regardless of, of how you try to equate that into a specific situation, okay, or, or or beyond the normal intent, basic logic in English would say, you know, I'm sorry. When you go to Black Lives Matter, okay, people who are ignorant, okay, and and you know. Anybody who doesn't know what Black Lives Matter is can be deemed ignorant to Black Lives Matter. No, I didn't, okay? I didn't and, say and, that, by and, the way. And then, I know, okay, I'm, I, okay. I did not say. Saying, when I say you, you can say, when I say, when I say you can say, do me a favor, take that as, as, as a general. hypothetical. No, 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 no. I'm, 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 I'm not pointing my finger. Yes, I understand that. I'm responding to the fact that you said that I made the statement, if you believe all lives matter, then you can't be my friend, and I never made that statement. I've never said anything okay, like that. Okay, you, 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 oh, sorry, on your, your Facebook post that brought mm -hmm. me to you today, mm -hmm. said it. No, it didn't. Okay, let me see if it's still there. It is. I'll read it for you verbatim, and if I'm wrong, then you know what? It you wouldn't know. be the first time. Okay, I like that. I like that. That's some humility right there. Yeah, because I never said if you believe all lives matter. What I said was if you make the statement all lives matter, and then you asked me to expound it, and I said yes. If you make that statement in response to Black Lives Matter, then yes, I consider that to be unfriendly. Do you understand how that goes away from basic English, right? I mean, the basic of all English, you know, all lives matter, and, it, and, it, and it, you find that offensive. Mm -hmm. I mean. How, how I, I, you know, I, I, I agree. I agree that you're saying now that you've so informed me about Black Lives Matter and and how how you're, you 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 are putting it in this text. I see it through your glasses. I understand it. And so I, you know, I, I, I I'll go with that. So then you don't have All a right? problem when other people use it, right? You don't feel. Well, hold on. So if you understand it, would you still feel compelled to retort with All Lives Matter in response to someone saying it? <sighs> It is it is an exclusionary statement. So then you it, don't understand. Really so then you don't understand what I mean by it. What no? What you're trying to tell me is that only you have to say only Black Lives Matter. You have to say only Black Lives Matter. If you don't say that, then you, then you really don't understand our cause. Is what you're saying. Is no. what I believe you are saying. What I'm saying. Well, yeah. What I'm saying is that in Black Lives Matter, the also is implied, and so is the two. And so for you okay, to okay, okay, imply. You see, do you see how that's that? You, do you see how this acronym? Do you see how this whole statement, the whole BLM? It, it's all controversial. It's all by design. So no, it's not. It's not no, 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 no. That's not it. So don't. So please don't. Please don't like erroneously in, interpret your own intention and 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 and, and uh, my impute. Conspiracy theory. It, wait, my yeah, conspiracy theory. Right, right. Don't 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 impute that onto everybody trying to bring awareness to a cause that's very near and dear to my heart that speaks to some of my real life experiences and those of my parents and those of my siblings. Please don't do that. So what happens here is at this point. You, you're at this point. I've explained to you exactly what Black Lives Matter meant. What, what, what exactly what Black Lives Matter means. So, when you feel the need to retort and rebut at this point, if you truly understand what it means, then it means that you're intentionally being dismissive. Okay, listen. Now that I know what it means, you wouldn't have a rebut. Oh, Black okay. Lives Matter. Yes. Good. Oh, okay. Cool. So do, do you think it's problematic that it's took nine years of this phrase existing in this many expositions in order for you to actually ascertain exactly what's mean or what's meant by that statement? Do I, do I what? Do you think it's problematic that it took nine years and countless exposition in order for you to understand what is meant by that phrase? No, I don't. You don't see that why that I would don't, be a problem for someone like me, right? Um, well, well, listen, for you, it depends on you. Like I said, I, ha I know people of color that, that, that live the happiest life there is, okay? They are not under a lash. They are not, they are not under a burden or chain. They, they thrive, and they, they, they live happily and prosper by choice. 
Are you implying that I'm not thriving? Are you implying that I'm not happy? Are you in, are you, what, what, what are you implying here? I am saying simply that, that people, uh, okay, okay, what I'm saying is, again, you, you are being combative. And what, the reason why I say that is because I said I know people that. And you're saying, are you implying that I? Right. No, that's not what I said, was it? Okay, so then what No, did, I said I know people that. Right, so then what does that have to do with the conversation at hand? Help me relate it so that I can understand. Maybe I'm missing Easy, something. easy. Again, racism is a living and breathing thing. Sure. You can choose to saturate yourself in it or you can choose to, to move away from it. And okay. again, I know people have done it successfully. So are you saying that I'm saturated? Like, I'm asking you, how does that relate to me in no, this conversation? Not, I don't know you from Adam, bro. I don't oh. know you from nobody. Okay, Listen, so then help I'm me understand. I know people. Okay. I know people that do this. I totally okay? understand. Whether you, you, you I get it. to do it or not is up to you. Hey, I know a, I know a, I know a ventriloquist that makes his living doing ventriloquism, and he's been doing it for about seven years. Listen, I'm not saying that... Because I, oh, I thought you're we were kidding. just introducing. You're I, twisting. You're no, twisting I thought you're we twisting. were just introducing said, random things that weren't that didn't said, even apply into a conversation just, no, that no, the two of us said, are having. I just said that I know people that do this. Okay, I'm not impugning any part of your life. Okay? Right, so it was just completely it was just completely extraneous. We're just mentioning random people that we know that aren't related to the conversation. No, sir. No, sir. To in terms, in terms of the in terms of the racial the racial issue uh, that you are that you, you are, are are discussing right now i'm saying people i know people that don't live this way don't live what way a, a life full of racism what 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 what, what are you that's i don't understand what you mean by that like, are you, so i i don't okay, i don't okay, okay, i know okay, so let me explain I don't it. you want to hear me explain it sure please okay then let me help you explain let me help you understand okay um i have people as friends, okay, who live not in racism. What does that mean? They don't. What does that mean? What does that mean? That means they, they don't. They don't. They 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 choose not to not to not to to dwell it. in that animal. Okay, I get it. I get it. So what I think. Uh, t tell me if I'm being fair here. What you're saying is you have friends that choose not to focus on racism. Is that what you're saying? Okay. Is that, yes, that's, that's part of it. Okay, sure. So here's where my problem with that is, is because I don't, I don't only concern myself with the plight that directly, that I directly experience. That to me is particularly selfish. What I do is I recognize that a lot of the systemic oppression affects many, many people, and I believe that it's healthy. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me, okay, wait. Hold on. Let me, I, I got you. Okay, got you. It is not, but let, okay. Let me finish my statement, and then you can tell yes, me. Yes, it is. Okay, great. Let me finish my Go statement. Ahead. Then you can tell me where it's different. So when I recognize the 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 extent of some of the systemic oppression that that certain people deal with, for me, I think it's beneficial when we have a conversation about these things in order to educate others, in order to motivate others to be part of the mechanisms of change. So for me, I think it's injurious to, to literally turn a blind eye to some of the great injustice that Americans Okay, face. I, totally, I totally disagree with you. Listen, when you talk about racism, you're gonna talk to two people, okay? okay. You're only gonna talk to two people. What, you're gonna you talk to people who already know what you're talking about and agree with what you're saying. And then you're going to talk to people who don't give a shit because they are racist. They don't want to hear what you have to say. So spreading the word ain't going to work. Okay? okay so what, me... what I'm talking about here, what I'm talking, there's only two people, there's only two, two answers you're going to get when you talk about racism. Okay. And the majority, the majority of people are going to hold your hand and buy you a beer. Okay. Of so, all colors. So here, let me explain. You want it. That, that, that's not my experience. So let me explain to you. As somebody who happens to have these kind of conversations, the reason why I'm willing to have this conversation with you, what I've discovered on countless occasions is me having a conversation with someone and explaining to them the various mechanisms in place that are used to oppress people of color um, and in, 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 in protected classes. And in doing so, some people become enlightened, some people become educated, some people walk away from the experience saying, 
wow, I've literally never heard about any of this, and now I understand exactly where you're coming from. That's been my experience on countless times. So to update you on there, there are three different kinds of people. There are the people who are already well aware and are just going to agree with me that would be an echo chamber. There are the people who are completely diametrically opposed because they genuinely don't care and might have some some like high levels of racism themselves, and those people will be unswayed despite how many analogies, despite how much you expound, and will still maintain erroneous interpretations of what you're saying and the data that you're presenting and all of those things. There are those type of people, and then there's a third. Hold on, and then and then there's a third class of people who will become educated, who will recognize the truth of what you're saying and the validity, and will become aware of an experience that differs greatly from their own and will be motivated to be an ally because they recognize some of the systemic oppression that you've experienced. That's okay, the third listen, class, and that's listen, the purpose of these conversations. Listen, 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 hear me out. Do you believe this, this, this warrants more conversation? Uh, sure. Okay, we're going to have to go to Chapter 2 because i got a job to do. I got you. Totally respect it. We'll have this conversation. Hey, listen, guys. Ready. We will be back. I will. I will tune out. Hey, you know what? You, you make you make interesting points, okay? And I have some interesting observations. So okay. we'll, we'll go. We'll go at this again, man. You have yourself a wonderful day. Alrighty, man. I love you. You take care. You stay up. You got it, bro. Love you too. Stay well. All right. Bye bye.